Thank you, George, and indeed, good afternoon. It's quite a crowd that we have here today, and it's an impressive crowd, and I, I for one, am delighted to be part of it. Uh, as you heard Representative Pickett introduce one of our colleagues today, I, too, want to mention that Representative Dan Mao from the 91st Legislative District, which includes parts of Adams and Franklin counties, has joined us today. I picked him up down at the Skyhaven Airport because Dan is not only a legislator, but he flies himself around the state in his airplane, and he had told me that he, has, he is really traveling around the state. He has really taken an interest in this industry, and he's done so because he truly believes, and I heard him tell a few of you here today, that natural gas is the future of not only Pennsylvania, but of our country. And indeed, as someone, as I for one, has been someone who has watched this industry develop and expand, and expand right here in our region, I think it's important that we host and have events such as today's to help educate our local businesses on, and the community on all the benefits and the uses of our, our locally, and it's locally harvested natural gas and that is what's so critically important. It's an empowering feeling to realize that we have clean, efficient, and reliable natural resource right here at home in Susquehanna County that can help lessen our dependence on the foreign markets of our energy needs. We've heard some, some really exciting statistics here today on the direction that this industry is taking us. And I want to thank and applaud Cabot who has been doing a great job in this community and partnering with, with not only the community but Pennsylvania businesses to construct the CNG fueling stations and encourage the use of alternative fuel vehicles, as well as they've built relationships with our regional schools and our regional colleges to train workers for our jobs in an ever-growing ever energy field. You heard folks talk today about uh, how important that is and how when the industry first came to these communities, it was hard to find individuals who were trained in this particular, in the development of natural grass. But thanks to the work of our Susquehanna Career and Technology Center, to Johnson College, to Lackawanna College, and other local college institutions, uh, they have actually stepped up to the plate and, and educated young people to have careers that, indeed, you heard they'll retire from someday. So I thank Cabot for what they're doing for initiating so much of, of what we're seeing here today. And uh, I thank you, for the, for, uh, George, for the opportunity to be here. Um, today's event has been a great display on how we can best leverage the use of natural gas energy in Pennsylvania. And I, for one, am indeed, as, as a member of the Pennsylvania House of Representatives, happy to be here and happy to be a part of this and happy to see how this has grown right here in Susquehanna County. So, again, thank you.